listen to your heart when it's calling for you. Listen to your heart. There's nothing else you can do. I don't know where you're going. And I don't know why. Listen to your heart. Before. I think that was for someone because today's theme song is actually Say something I'm giving up for you I'll be the one if you want me to And anywhere I would have followed you so say something I'm giving up And I So Cancer and hi, welcome into the channel. This is Sage, Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you for being here. I love you. Welcome in if you're new. Welcome in, hit the subscribe button and become a part of this family here and if you're returning you know much love big up yourself so these are general tarot card messages for the sign of cancer sun moon rising and venus cancerian all right so um the general messages may not apply to all of you so you have to take the ones that are playing the rest let them fly also thank you so much for liking the video every time you hit like you know i feel that so thank you. Thank you for sharing the messages. When you hit share, you share on your WhatsApp group, Facebook groups, in your blogs. That means a lot to me. That means you're sharing messages that resonates with you and inspires you. So I feel that. Thank you so much for subscribing and for being here. And now, someone, I wanted to do a money reading for you, but someone wants to move toward you in love. Now, this is serious. The song that came for you was Say Something, I'm Giving Up On You. But it's actually in Pentatonic's cover. You know, it's Pentatonic's cover of Say Something, I'm Giving Up On You. That song with Christina Aguilera. That is the theme song. It's been playing in my head since around 4 o'clock this morning. I'm not sure if that's Cancerian's vibration. As if you, you were maybe just hoping... Not talking to this person, but just maybe hoping that their energy would come toward yours or something. Or this is your person. Say something I'm giving up on you. But then another song. Okay. Another song came through um, while I was shuffling the cards. And it's listen to your heart. That one. When it's calling for you. Listen to your heart. There's nothing else you can do. I don't know where you're going. And I don't know why. But listen to your heart before you tell him goodbye. So. Oh, someone in your family. Or, yeah, someone in your family, though. The three and the five. Coming around to you. This person is a soulmate. What? And, 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 and there's a person that's looking to move, like, come back to you. As if they feel... The fire... What? <laughs> it just feels like this person, this this over here is a blazing tree because I feel it's his a lot of heat, attraction. This three of wands. Now this person is heading toward this this burning tree, this fire. What the? Oh 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 oh! A sacrifice because remember this the story with the burning tree in the Bible was what about believing in Christ? Really, right, right, right. 
something like that. Believing in the works of God. Burning tree. Now I really feel some, someone is seeing this. Or they're heading to this. Oh, the burning tree feels like a miracle. And I hear a testimony and I feel like, like it's the truth. It represents the truth. You know what I mean? This tree, this burning three of wands. It's as if this, someone is coming back, this jack of diamonds. And, 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 and this is a lot, a lot of passion and love because they love this burning tree that they're coming back to. You know what I mean? It's like this person wants to come, sit, um, pull up a chair around this tree and just sit and watch this tree burn. It's like this, this passion that they have or this desire, this attraction. I feel like they left before because they know about the burning tree. <laughs> they know about this tree. They feel it. They know it is alive and well and burning. And, and, and I feel like it gives them happiness. And um, so this Jack, they're, they're looking to come back around. Maybe they are a part of this burning tree. Maybe they were your family. It's, yeah, but the energy is this person, they left maybe to find the truth or something. They thought this wasn't the truth. Like this person really ignored the burning tree when they first saw it and left. And it's like when they went wherever, there wasn't any other tree that was burning like this. There was nothing like this. There was nothing, not even the, not even the essence of a possibility that there's a burning tree other than this place. So this person is like, okay, this is the source of the passion, right? So they came, they, they made their way, they were, their way back. It's, I don't feel like, I'm not sure if they're there yet, but they're on their way. They're visualizing what the tree will look like. They're just excited to get there because it's like it's going to make them feel happy. Like, oh my goodness, all along, this was really what was true. It was true. The burning tree is burning. You know what I mean? I'm not sure if I'm getting it. Hmm. So maybe someone did not believe in you, Cancer. This possibly a love relationship. But this person is coming as a jack of diamonds. Um, Earth sign, Cancer. Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I'm wondering if you're looking. What is it? I can't. I'm not. I'm not feeling it. I'm, I'm feeling like the earth sign right now. You know how earth signs, they don't get emotionally attached. And like water signs where you can't, you can't feel it. I'm not feeling this. I'm not feeling it at all. I feel like this Jack of Diamonds that just sees something and is not having that emotional rooted connection to it. It's just this person is kind of superficial. This Jack of Diamond. They see things. It's like this person just follows a trend. This wouldn't be the one that would co they could come up with an idea for a trend, you know. But it would be the one that would do something and not understand why they're doing it, but is so excited to do it. Like, oh my God, I want to be a part of this. But they have no idea what they can't really f know it or feel it. Maybe that's why they're so attracted to it they just can't understand it and i feel like this good is your blazing this blazing tree this blazing fire is you it's you this person's coming back around to you it's like you show them magic or miracle or things that they can't witness anywhere else and they thought as if it was nothing like oh sure you know like sure and then they walked away it's as if this is their source of life, really, this fire. It's their energy. It's almost like maybe you could be this person's muse, you know? Yeah. You could be this person's muse because they can't really connect to the soul source. They just see the light and it's beautiful and they like beautiful things. So this person is one that likes to dress up, likes to bling out. This is actually a well-being, thinks well, you know? has a good clear mindset 
um, has a vision, has a purpose, is a not a dream chaser, but this is a worker committed to work. This one keeps their word also. Um, right? It's like nothing else out there in the rest of the world was like this that they felt this with this burning tree here with you and i don't know where else i'm going with that reading so show me something else please what is the jack of diamonds the six of diamonds like this person is a giver this person likes to give but they also like to receive but they give, they give willingly, easily, like they just give, they give money, they give advice, they give their time because they do, as I say, they feel good. This person works on their internal value, whether that's taking care of their health, their mental space, their body. And so they present as that well-being. They look good. They're sharp. They're clear, dressed well, always freshening up, likes cologne and, and watches and jewelry and just likes to and nice handbags and nice shoes this is that jack of diamonds vibration okay so they do so they are attracting they attract they attract what they are so i feel like this person is always maybe wealthy has money coming in because they're sharing, they give, so they receive. So they're always in that frequency. They, they be around people that that has to give to them, you know. And they find themselves around people that they can give to. Yeah, in a community. Hey, this per it's like this person is thinking. You know, this person is thinking. Their heart is in their eyes, if I can, if, if that makes sense. What is what the feeling that they have in their heart to move toward this burning tree? It is in their eyes. It's like the only thing they think about and visualize now is that burning tree and being close to it. Okay. So, oh, child. So, there was someone else involved in this situation. But this, I'm getting upset. You know, <laughs> I don't want to cuss, but I'm going to control my emotions. I'm going to present as the queen of cups here. Because I don't, I think this person is still coming around with, with this baggage. Or maybe, uh, like, oh my goodness. The things that they know you don't want. And I'm hearing a lot of garbage cans, like tongue long long trash cans. Drung, uh, uh, what the? F and this person is coming around with that. They know you don't want that, you know. But they're still deciding to walk toward you with it. Anyway, um, I also I feel like this person had another person, or there was a third party involved here in this relationship. And who was that? Cancer, I'm feeling maybe someone else had your heart. Your heart. So it's maybe third party situation both ways. I'm not certain. But I do know that this person, they, their heart was broken. They were disappointed. You know. Um, mm-hmm. What the heck? This person is coming with something. As they could be dressed as a farmer. I, I, even I'm telling you that this person dresses well. I'm feeling that this person is just coming out of the bushes with the machete in hand. Like a farmer. But they still look good. And they're coming with all these things. The six of cups is past love or past relationship. It's like this person went back into an old place to take something and then come back. It's like maybe they went back to their ex. For real, for real. 
it's like they but the x feels like a pocket that you can just like they're saying hold on let me just go get this thing hold on and you're like no don't do that it's legal and <laughs> what the heck but then they, they they decided to go into this pocket to retrieve something that i feel belonged to them or they feel belong to them in this pocket which can be a really this situation with their ex but it feels like they just got they just wanting to retrieve something to cut to be on this journey forward that makes sense so now they feel like i feel like now they feel like you you are you are distanced from them and they're making their way to you but this person has a lot of luggage or garbage or bags and they feel happy because they feel like they succeeded in what they went for, what they were fishing for in the past. So they're coming to you like, hey, I got it, I got it. But what's that? They're still coming back with a third party energy once more. They, it's so wrong, this energy. I don't, I don't, and I don't especially dig this, what they did. I don't feel like this person was thinking, huh? Because the thing that they took is not, I feel it's haunting them and they're bringing it with them toward you. They took. Hmm. They took because it's like they went into a dark place. Maybe they want to give back to you what they took. Maybe they took something from you. The Ace of Pentacles, like that's money vibration here. And I was talking about going into someone's pocket. So maybe this person stole from you or you are this person's past that they want to come back around to. Or they want to put something in your pocket. Replace it. I don't know. But this is this is this is amazing it's like this this is the source the ace like they took your vision your seed your core your spirit your destiny it they, like they took it from you in that pocket space feels like that sacred space where you keep your vision and your dreams and so I, I, that's why i was upset you know it's like this person went in and they took it from you. Now this dark space, like a pocket, it's like your soul space. It's like they got to know you really, learned about your dreams and your visions, and then they took. It's almost like this person, even though they dress up well, they're a beggar. You know, they feel lack. But this burning tree, what do they, they want to come back around to, to, is the energy of a beggar or a homeless person that witness, that, um, witnesses, randomly witnesses some miracle happening. And then it may have given them some magic. And this is you. And, but they always felt lack. In vibration as if they didn't have they couldn't feel these powers on their own but what you gave them was more than they ever felt it was like love and rootedness and family and groundedness and happiness and this person has always been superficial and so they got to know you I'm sorry that the reading is turning out this way and they came around to you, stole your, your, and I feel like they may have presented as your twin flame, your vibration, you know. This person probably was a magician. But they know how to smile and keep happy and make you happy and others around them seem to be happy. Everyone thinks this person is like the best person ever. It's that kind of a deceit. And in the background, they're going around and stealing from you. And cancer, yeah, your energy, they do, they do fuck with you, they do fuck with your energy, my baby. You know what, 
there's going to be life coming back. I'm not saying you're dead or whatever, but the, 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 the life, the breathe, the breath, the energy, the aliveness, all of it is restoring them. It's like magic. But burning tree, you're, you're still burning, right? You're still in love. It's, it's that energy of this person thought they stole from me, right? And they know, they're hearing like, the tree is still burning over there in the distance. And they're like, what? The tree is still burning? And they've tried to make their way back to this burning. Like, I can't believe it's still burning. It's the energy of Alibaba for finding the gold in the cave. And they thought they took it all. Or they thought they destroyed it. But these cards look beautiful either way on your side. The Queen of Cups today with the Ace of Pentacles. Even though they stole from you, I feel like you're safe, you're protected. And something is coming back towards you. Your life, your energy, your passion, your destiny. Cancer, I feel like you had some visions. Some, some visions, like you wanted to build community gardens, you wanted to create harmony, write books. You shared all of this with this person. And they were just listening like, oh, oh well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But like in the back of their mind, they were wondering, how can I sell this? How can I make money off of this? How can I, how can I, you know, how can I use this content to, because they feel so lack. And the thing is that they didn't believe in like you and this like they didn't believe it was for you and them to capitalize on your ideas and your vision they just they, they would sell it to someone else you know what i mean they would sell your vision to someone else this is how this person thinks but it's coming back to you oh child i feel like cry i feel like for crime no lie because You know why it just it's beautiful because it really belongs to you and it can only be yours this is your spirit your spirit that they stole your destiny your essence whatever it was and it's like it's literally making its way back to you because it can only be used by you it is yours and you thought you thought you lost it you thought this person could have really taken from you you were like, oh my God, I lost my feelings, my energy, my burning passion, my destiny, my thrill, whatever. Whatever you felt like you lost. But it's like this person can't use it. Maybe that's why they're returning it to you. They can't use it. They cannot. And whosoever they tried to sell it to can't use it to. And it's, it's, it's either. And I feel like the person they tried to give your things to looked at it and was like, hmm. I can't use this. Take it back to the owner because the person that they tried to sell it to is wiser. Let me see. Because the person they tried to give it to knows better. It's like, it's like they tried to, it's like they stole your, this person would have been somebody that can change it and transform it into something else. And this person said, I can't, I can't do this. I can't break this down. This per the minute this person saw this vision, they knew it was something sacred. I don't know who this person is, oh, but there's someone. It can be like a witch doctor, a doctor, a, 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 a voodoo doctor or somebody like that. Oh my God, I'm not doing that. But I'm just saying that's the energy of how this person tried to like they try they, they try to take what's yours and bring it to their other friend who is also a part of this thing it's like stealing cars and taking it to a your their, your friend who is a part of the act and your car your friend would scrap the car and turn it into something else or diamond or jewelry you see what i mean it's value that they took but this person saw it as like antique and rare and unfuckwithable and it can't be broken down. So they're like, uh, uh I can't work with this one, son. But it's like, they're not even telling this person everything, you know. They're not telling them everything. They, this person is like, a, I don't want to do it. But this person is like a this decrepit invalid. 
that doesn't know anything and is trying i feel like that was too much because it's all within us and it's it's trying to make to present as to be a part of a league it's the energy of this one wants to hurry up and go out and steal steal cars to prove that he can do this but any the person who is working for is like uh -uh, take this one back it's like magic i'm telling you this is like a watching a movie that's auto made automatic and then your destiny you know it's like floating back to you like magic cancer belongs to you it's yours it itself is alive it is it is your kin that's why the ace of pentacles here says twin of twin twin flame i was going to say, say twin of flames twin of flames oh because we're talking about the burning fire right this is yours you are going to see all of your vision through you 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 will you will oh my god it's so beautiful you will you know you will it says twin flame i feel well feeling well new vision and newness the queen of cups says secretive big heart joy soulful emotional cute beautiful loving whole lot of feelings in you like all of that and they're very alluring and i'm also feeling like wholeheartedness and confidence i'm getting the energy of a grandmother like a very old soul not like your grandmother but i'm getting the energy of a gr not not you but a grandmother vibration that's the safety because you know when i was growing up old people kind of made us feel safe because there are certain things that you wouldn't say around them or do around them. So when you're in their presence, especially old women, you're not going to, you're not, you don't expect boys to violate you. You know, you are your parents. You expect more respect when you're in the presence of old people, like ancestors, vibration. That's the energy that I feel like you're in the home of old people. You're good. The burning tree. Tell me more about the burning tree for cancer. What is the burning tree? Could be a place of business or a home. I hear a lucky, whoa, look. I hear a lucky something. The two of pentacles and the five of swords are lucky break a lucky break and then the ten of pentacles um came out after that and this is like a lot of money newness it's like breaking through a new atmosphere like whenever i see the ten of pentacles i'm hearing magical sounds like fairy dust being sprinkled like breaking through a new world and it's like the slow motion and the awe oh, and all the magic coming around yeah that's the new vibration. I'm going to find a, a name for the Ten of Pentacles. It's like all your wishes coming true vibration. Stars. This is money, you know. New money. New streams of money. Multiple streams of income. You're like getting a breakthrough. A lucky break. But why is it lucky? Why is the break lucky? Oh, it could have been lucky because it maybe it has something to do with the merchant who was going to turn your your ace of pentacles, your vision and so on into something else. You know, maybe this person somehow is connected to your ancestors. So I'm saying the minute they saw this, they recognize it. They know this person too is a visionary. And they know this is you're going to fulfill this. That's what I'm saying. It's like they're smiling in their hearts while handing it back to this Stephen person. That's um, like they're smiling and going, you can't take this one. And they're smiling. It's like confirmation for this person to know that there is this vision. I can't. Mm -mm, it's nice. It's really powerful, Cancer. I mean, whatever it is that you have to do, your dreams and your visions, even 
even those that you had since you were young, they mean something to the entire, to, to something divine. You know, it's your mission to fulfill. And for some people, if you feel like you don't have that passion, that burning tree energy where you're just blazing, you know who you are, you're, you found yourself in love. Um, dream again. Dream again. Dream again. Start from here. Start from where you are and create from that this place now. How do I go from here? Who am I? What do I want to be? What do I want to create? What kind of fun do I want to have? What kind of life do I want to live? Dream again, reignite that spark within you, blaze. You know what I mean? And sometimes you need to burn a fire, literally, in many ways, many different ways to calm the mind and to remove obstacles. Oh, this person is sorry, the fuck. I literally asked about this person. Oh my God. I said, tell me about this person. That stole from cancer that's coming around. And these two cards come out. The Jack of Hearts. It says, say something. This is my say something card. And it's the song that we were talking about earlier. Say something, I'm giving up on you. Say something. I want, I long, I hope. It is my wish to achieve you. And it comes with the Two of Swords card, which says, sorry. So, I'm not sure if this person is coming to say sorry on their own initiative or if they're sent to tell you sorry because they realize what they've done. Mm I'm not sure if you made a wrong decision. What is this? Moving on, moving forward. Um, look back, don't look back. Past love, familiar feelings, naturally, natural love, deeply in love. Prosperity, seven of pentacles, being sober, welcome to a place of magic. Hopeful expectations welcome in. Um, a lot of prosperity. And then we have this is true love. And that came out for the question. Will cancer oh will cancer fulfill that destiny? You know, cancer, it's real, it's, I want to know what that wrong decision is. It's like it's saying, to, you know, this destiny is more like connecting with yourself, healing, promoting well-being, dreaming. And the way you will live every single day. It's almost like, I don't want to tell you you have this big grand vision and you're sitting there like, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to start motorcycling or something huge like that? It's more about how the love you live every day. Live the life you live, love the life you love. Love the life. Mm -hmm. Love the life you live and live the life you love. Mm -hmm. They stole from the wrong one. All right, we're leaving these messages here, though. I did a reading title that before, though. They stole from the wrong one. Yeah. They stole from the wrong one. If you haven't watched that reading, do go ahead and watch it. Cancer. All right. I'll see you in the next one. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Share the messages on your way out. Remember that you're all in. All is within you. I'll see you next time.